Good morning and rise and shine to all. So, today, this is gonna be a really short video. Uh, of course, I got things to do, but I still wanna dedicate a little of my time to YouTube. So, I'm gonna talk about spoofing uh, and how Niantic is going to try to uh, stop the spoofing and why I think. Uh, that's a terrible idea in a way and why it's good in a way most of you already know but uh, while I'm talking about that I'm also going to be evolving this topic into a jump up first time ever actually um okay so oh, here we go first evolution Okay, so this is actually my second skip one. I'm trying to get another jump up. Uh, well, not another jump up, but well, when I go on my second one, I'm gonna... let's see if that's actually high. Yep. But yeah, let me talk about uh, why I believe that it's a good thing. But first, jump up. I should have put a lucky egg on. I actually didn't. I actually forgot. And look at that bullety and energy ball. Okay. All right. So. Guys, but yeah, so this is why I believe that, um, <clears throat> oh, excuse me, this is why I believe that, um, if my voice is shaking, it's because it's a little scratchy. I need to get some to drink. Um, but yeah, the reason I think that spoofing is a good thing is because it's like I said in my other video, my previous video. You know, in FSU ATL, he brought up a good, um, a good story about this, and, I, and I'm gonna mention it. But someone could be in the hospital trying to play Pokemon Go, trying to catch Pokemon, and you really can't. But you want to play the game. You know what I mean? Like, it could be cold outside, it could be snowing outside, it could be sick, like now I have a scratchy throat. You know, it could be thunderstorming outside, anything. You might just be tired and don't want to go outside. It might be too cold or whatever. That's why I think spoofing is good. The reason why I think it's bad, because like people talk about, only reason why they dislike it is actually because of, only because of the gems. Now, if every, everybody stops spoofing to the gems and stop, you know, uh, you know, trying to battle them and taking the gems over and defeating them or whatever. I don't really think people would stop talking about, um, I don't think people would talk about speaking so much. Uh, there's a few YouTubers, um, that talks about how they dislike spoofing. I like spoofing. Because, like, right now it's cold outside. That, that's why I'm got my turtleneck on and my, uh, scully. I actually got some slippers on. Uh, here's the thing. No one's gonna be playing Pokemon Go. Like, I was trying to play Pokemon Go the other day when I was in Bloomfield, but the problem was my hands was freezing. I had to keep putting my gloves on, taking my gloves off. That's why I'm thinking about investing in some gloves that I can actually, uh, it's like touchscreen gloves. Uh, if I can obtain some of those, then it wouldn't be that big a deal. Or it wouldn't be that bad. But, you know, people should have spoofing or have the opportunity to spoof because either way you're still catching pokemon regardless it's not gonna break the game it hasn't break the, broken the game thus far so they shouldn't really be talking about it they only talk like i said they only talk about it because of people keep taking the gems over and, and whatever so john hankey should not or niantic should not do anything about spoofing even though they are but it's going to take away from a lot of YouTubers that do hacking just for entertainment purposes. FSU ATL for one. Shout out to you FSU. I feel your pain. But, <clears throat> yeah, but I really believe that they shouldn't do that. 
But if they're gonna do it, they should do it half and half, so people can choose to hack with it, and some people don't, you know, can't choose hacks. But then again, it wouldn't matter because if they had like a button where you could turn that on and off, people are gonna turn it on regardless, and people gonna turn uh, turn it off regardless. Here's the thing, FSU ATL, what he was talking about was people are gonna create their own um, servers where they can still hack, so you really can't put a stop to it. But like you said, he goes out and you know he. Uh, actually um, plays Pokemon Go and just like me I actually go out playing Pokemon Go you know and I do this for entertainment purposes now this is my main account yes but I spoof sometimes like early I was spoofing because like I said it's cold outside that's why I have all this on I even got a, a heater right here I'm trying to stay warm but anyway I just want to let FSU ATL know this is straight to, straight to you I want to say this, this is my way of backing you, because, like I said, I feel your pain, and as long as they take away hacking, you're really not going to have a channel anymore, because your channel channel is, is on hacking, but like you said, for entertainment purposes, and I see that, and whether you hack or not, that's your business, no one really needs to know that, and other people need to stop putting your business out there. Trainer Tips and Mystic 7. Even though I follow you guys, I just think Mystic 7 personally, you shouldn't put FSU out there like that. Just let Niantic and everyone else follow it. You know what I mean? I mean, not follow it, but let them find it out. But I think you guys are still cool. FSU, you know, more Allie, Trainer Tips, Reversal, Mystic 7, all, all you guys. I follow all of you guys. If you uh, want, I really wish you guys would follow me. I'm also on Twitter. And I'm also on Facebook. Um, but yeah, so but that's just it. But uh, I'm getting ready to go, guys. And uh, I just want to keep this video short. It's actually just over seven minutes. So, guys, with that said, this is 1818JTS. Make sure you guys get this video to at least a thousand likes. Uh, with that being said, um, yeah, so. Uh, Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace. I'm out.